All right, Pitt beat Coker College in its exhibition game tonight, 83-40. Yeah, it was a bit of a blowout, 83-40, yeah. Um, it's very hard. I can't really tell you that much about Pitt after this game, to be flat out honest with you. I mean... It's one thing to play a college five levels below you, five tiers, five or six tiers below you. I mean, yeah, Pitt's a high D1, Coker's somewhere in D2, but felt like about a five-tier difference. And then for the team on the low tier to just play a really, really bad game was just, I don't know. I didn't get much out of it. I mean, when I first watched, I was more sad than anything. Sad that we're not going to get to see last year's team play again. And I'm really going to miss watching them play because I, I really enjoyed last year's team. So, from what little I saw... Kind of impressed by Dwight Miller how he played. Um, I didn't see we didn't see much of Dante Taylor. He had foul issues early. Um, Trey Whittle, Woodall looked really good. Gary McGee looked really good. But again, the competition was I'll stinko. Um, I didn't get to the Slippery Rock game. I didn't have my tickets in time. They've been having issues with the ba basketball tickets at the pit ticket office. Which, if you follow any of the online message boards, you'd know, you would have known about. Um, the games start for real on um, Friday. Pitt hosts Wofford. Pitt won both their exhibition games. I mean, they beat Slippery Rock in the first one, not very impressively, but could be worse. You could be in the situation Syracuse is in when they lost to Lemoyne. I mean,. You don't ever want to lose to a Division II school. You really don't want to lose to a Division II school right across town from your school is. I mean, Syracuse will be fine, but still it's embarrassing. Pitt did not get that embarrassment. I don't know what what conclusions we can draw from this game other than Pitt basketball is very young this year and will be a work in progress. So, that's it. Have a nice evening. I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.